Hello and welcome to Tea Time with Ghost, a show where I drink tea and talk about my opinions even though nobody asks for them. I'm your host Ghost and today I will be talking about my thoughts on AI. Let's get into it. At first, I wasn't really going to talk about this, but every day something else comes out about AI and every day it worries me more and more about how much it's grown and the lack of laws surrounding it. I really think AI is a very interesting thing with a lot of potential. There could be so much good it could do, but in the wrong hands, I can only really fear the worst since a lot of AIs are either free or behind a paywall. Almost anybody can just get their hands on it and do whatever they like, which is honestly terrifying. In the corrupt world that we're already in, it's so scary the things that people could do with it. Even if there are laws in place, laws never stopped people from committing crimes, so it's it's dangerous the things it could do. I've already seen people post about how they've lost their job to AI. In the future, I want a job that has to do with art. Whether that's 3D or 2D animation, I don't care, I just want to be an artist. Whether that form of art is writing or drawing or sculpting, I want to create things. But knowing that one day that might not be possible and a robot may take away my job, it's terrifying. Just a few days ago, I wasn't too concerned because AI art, it it sucks, it's obvious. But then I see this AI generated video that looks like this. Yes, it has mistakes, but what the hell? Why is it, why is this, what is this? Why is it getting better? Why can it make things better than I can? It's so frustrating seeing this. Seeing people lose their jobs over it, seeing people use AI to make inappropriate images of people and blackmail them, seeing them use this tool to harm people instead of help them, it's sad and scary. It's honestly very disheartening seeing artists be replaced and big creators such as Nicki Minaj use AI art instead of commissioning an actual artist and I know she has the money. Nicki is considered an artist, her form of art being music. I don't think I don't think she would like it if somebody just took her voice and made a song that she didn't get paid for. AI art is also technically stolen art since the AI has to learn somehow and it takes from other artists and matches it all together to look like quote unquote original art. Your art can be taken without your consent and made into someone else's original art. AI art shouldn't even be considered art. Art is made by real people. Without effort, put in by a real person, it's just a soulless void of nothingness. It has no meaning. Art is an amazing thing that people have used in many ways to express themselves, and it kind of sucks that this is happening right now. Though it's obvious I have strong opinions on AI, I also believe it's okay to use in certain situations. Please don't use AI to replace an artist or write a book and publish it. Okay, editor ghost here. While trying to get this video done, I was watching a video and found out that somebody did in fact use AI to make and publish multiple books. And this guy who did it was also responsible for Willie's Chocolate Experience, the scam that took people's money and gave them one jelly bean and a half a cup of lemonade. So if you think I'm dramatic for saying people are using AI to make books, there's your example. <laughs> anyway, back to the video. Please commission real artists, get a ghostwriter or something, or just write it yourself. I don't care if it's bad, at least it's authentic. But if you're using AI just for fun, go on ahead. Artists can use AI images as references for their own art. It's actually a trend where artists redraw AI images to actually make it their own. As long as you're not using it as a replacement but a tool, I think you're fine. Just don't do anything disgusting and you're good. What I don't support is people attacking others for using AI to just have fun or do a trend. That's honestly crazy. This TikToker named Mace Place, his content used to revolve only on his cat and they used to make such cute videos together, but sadly his cat Cooper has passed away. After his cat Cooper had passed away, he had used AI art to generate an image of what Cooper would have looked like in a Disney movie. And the comments straight up attacked him, which is actually crazy. It's his pet, his best friend, and he's mourning him. He's posting a silly little trend, and this is what you do. What? I'm so concerned and confused. Why would you do this? I actually find it so insane that you could see somebody grieving the loss of their pet, and you just go into the comments and be like, um, actually, AI is bad, so y no. Shut up, no. What is wrong with you? I don't care how much you hate AI, even though it is a real issue, but now is not the time to be doing this. Please stop. I actually find it insane how people act sometimes. I swear y'all must have been raised by wolves. I want AI to be a tool to help, not to replace, and I hope in the near future that's what it becomes. But with all the horrible people out there and big companies willing to throw away people, I doubt that's what's going to happen for a little while. Disney has already started to use AI art in shows just to test the waters. And yeah, I saw it get backlash, but Disney gets backlash for a lot and it still doesn't listen. All I can really do is continue to speak out and hope for the best. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Stay determined and have a miraculous day. Ghost out. Another short video, but yeah, this was an important topic I wanted to touch on. I don't really have much more to say than... 
please support real artists instead of AI. I'm tired of seeing these AI artists claiming their work is just as valuable as real artists work. You typed in a few words. I sat here for hours putting in the work and learning how to draw. Even if I'm not the best artist, your quote unquote art is nothing compared to mine or other real artists. If you have the means and you want a cool looking art piece, just commission an artist. Don't want to? Learn how to draw. Anybody can do it. It's not easy, but anybody can learn. It's not just artists here that are in danger. AIs are getting more and more advanced. The next thing you know, your job will be on the line next. So just keep that in mind.